All right, guys, I thought you might get a kick out of this one. For those of you that don't know how, to, how a wastegate works, so this part of your wastegate here is what is going to be attached to your exhaust. And essentially what it does is this flap will open and it will bypass some of the exhaust pressure and send it out of a bypass. So this is controlled by spring pressure. So you have springs in this cap right here that determine the pressure at which something pushing on this can open or in the case of uh, a boost reference. So right now I just have regulated air going in, pretend this is the boost coming from your turbo or from your intake manifold. So now you can see, see if I can get you a good shot here. You can see we're basically at zero PSI. Now I'm gonna increase that, and this spring is set at 35 PSI. So as we ramp, you'll see this kind of go up as we go here. You can see it starting to crack open. As I apply a little more boost, a little more boost, you can see this thing opening up. And then when, when we drop the boost pressure back down, as I drop the boost pressure back down, you can see it closes. So now we're back to low boost. Now we're getting on it, we're getting on it. The exhaust is building. Now we're starting to, we just cracked it. We're bypassing a little. Now we're full boost for bypassing a whole bunch of exhaust pressure. So this is how a wastegate works. Okay, so now that we bench tested it, we're gonna go put this sucker in.